Hey, what's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Stephen Davidson here in a shave video. I've got about two and a half days worth of beard growth, so let's get started. We'll prep my face off camera with the Barber Soul 1919 Leatherless Shave Cream. I've had it soaking while I was in the shower. We'll go with my uh, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Atomic Rocket 26 millimeter Synthetic Brush. Very nice. And temporarily, I'll explain, I'm going to use my Gillette Skin Guard again. I've been using it for the last couple of weeks, so I'll fill you in on that. I've, I've uh, had a real bad couple real bad spots and cuts that have been slow to heal, so I've been having to use it right here. And right here, and it still hasn't healed up quite where I wanted to, so I'm going to use that temporarily, of course. And to start today's party, I don't know how I do it, but uh, I always get water everywhere where I don't need it to. I'm going to go with Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements Enigma Machine, which is a strawberry and oud wood. It kind of reminds me of sex wax for the surfboards. A very, very nice scent. And I'm going to finish it off with the matching aftershave cologne. Alright. When I come back, I should be fully prepped and lathered up, so stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. Yogurt, anyone? Check out the gorgeous lather. All right. All right, now the reason I've been using my skin guard, ladies and gentlemen, is I got myself really bad right here and right here, and it's been extremely slow to heal. I tried it with my 316, and uh, it just didn't quite work out too good. It took the hide clean off, bled everywhere. So I thought, well, let's try the leaf, and that was a, not much better, but it still caused issues. So until that heals up fully, I've been using this, the Gillette Skin Guard, and I've got a fresh blade on there. So let's get this started. Fantastic scent. Oh. Got a question not long ago. Um, somebody asked me if I could do one more straight razor shave, and I'm like, no, I'm afraid not. My hand shakes too much now due to the numerous surgeries I had in the past. It's a drawback. It's one of the. It's a permanent uh, side effect. from where I was putting a coma 10 years ago. They had to put me in a coma to do a couple, some surgery, which turned into three surgeries in less than 30 days to get rid of cancer. Okay, right in here. See how it's still sensitive? I was out cold for six and a half days. And the other half day I spent it high. But the good thing about that is somebody walked past me that had been smoking. And it made me sick, and I have not touched a cigarette since. I've been smoke-free for 10 years now, and I don't regret it at all. So that's good. I mean, uh, my surgeon had done all the surgery after post-op, and he says I was only the third one. He got to quit. I told him it didn't take much. When I described to him what it was, and he automatically knew which personal care assistant it was. 
I won't buy me have been smoking. I said, dude, I don't know what it was, but it was rotten. And it made me sick, and I ain't touched it since. Unfortunately, my dad never did quit after his first lung surgery. After his first bout with cancer, where they had to take out half of his lung. And uh, he says he quit. He never really did. He pretty much was afraid he'll take it from him and say anything at that point to keep doing it. But, uh, yeah, he never did quit and eventually got up to him in 2020. All right. Definitely going to need another pass, so I'm going to go off camera and finish up. So finish the shave itself, and then when I come back, we'll finish her off and recap. So stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. I ended up doing uh, another pass against the grain and a half pass on the neck. So let's go ahead and uh, recap and finish her up. I prepped my face off camera with the Barbasol 1919 leather the shave cream. Good stuff, really slick. That's my pre shave. I went with my Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Atomic Rocket 26mm Synthetic Knot. And I believe this might do it for a while. I'll probably go back to the leaf. I don't know yet. It's still trying to heal up in there a bit. But I think it's healed up enough to where I can go in there and shave. But uh, I went with my Gillette Skin Guard. Fresh Blade. And the star of the party was... Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Enigma Machine, which is a strawberry oud wood type scent. Kind of reminds me of sex wax for the surfboards. That's kind of what this is. And to finish it off, we're going to finish it off with the matching aftershave splash. So let's get some of the good stuff on here. Yeah, baby. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm also thinking about getting another new razor. I haven't decided yet. A Henson Loud AL13 or whatever it is. Off of Maggots. I haven't decided yet. <clears throat> I kind of don't want to because <clears throat> I'm happy with my leaf and Edward Jagger 316. You know what? Let's double dose it. All right. Fantastic. Oh, yes. Mm. Mm. As my dad would say, ease up on the women bait, son. You're killing me over here. <laughs> yeah, it will Hard to believe it's been two years now since he's been gone, but oh well. Pneumonia caused by complications from lung cancer. Second time he had it. Alright. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys again real soon. Take care and God bless. Later, ladies and gentlemen.